Hi everyone, it's Rupert here from BMW Mini Direct and I'm here today with not a BMW or a Mini, it's a Ford Focus ST Diesel. Um, I have to say, I'm really impressed with this car. We get to drive a lot of different vehicles uh, in this job and this car goes like an absolute rocket. It's as tight as it, it seems as when it was new. I mean, it just drives absolutely superbly. It's in fantastic condition. It's got a full service history. We've just done a cam belt on it as well. So it doesn't need its cam belt change. Um, and it just, it just pulls and pulls and pulls and corners like you wouldn't believe. So let me go and show you the condition of the car uh, and you can judge for yourself, but it's in this really lovely blue color. It's got the um, LED Xenon lights at the front there as well, which um, really help in seeing in the dark um, the front of the car i mean this is a performance car and there really isn't much to show by any way of chips or damage to the car there are a few little marks which i will point out to you but nothing really you know even right down low here some really tiny little chips but on the whole i would have to say for the type of car that it is it's done about 75 77 thousand miles something like that so you know it's not as if it's been stood still but it really does look <laughs> like it has been so um alloy wheels plenty of tread on the tires the alloy wheels are pretty good the front discs are really good as well they've recently been changed pads are really good um, a small amount of corrosion around the valve which i think tends to be the case um, on on this car uh, if you were really, really pernickety, you might have the alloy wheels um, done. But on the on the face of it, they're not sort of curbed on the edges or anything like that. So they look pretty good. No dents on the car. Bodywork again, all the way along here as we come along. Really, really nice. Edge of the mirrors, really good. All on the roof is fantastic. Doors, really good. Passenger door. As we come around here, this rear quarter, all very nice. Slight, slight mark there. I think it's because it's literally just behind that tire. It's a plastic panel, so it's not gonna rust or anything like that. PDC at the back, so park distance control, that's nice to have. Um, lovely spoiler there as well. Great big boot, look at that, massive. Um, and the bumper there is in all in good condition. It's not like anything's been jumping in and out with claws or anything like that. It's really, really nice. There's no smells in this car. There's nothing, no smoke, no dog smell, nothing like that. Um, so this panel here, nothing around here, around the villa flap, so that's really good. So the one part, I suppose, is just this little bit here. It's on a plastic panel, just needs just a touch up there. Um, we haven't got the right colour paint, but I'm sure we can order it and do that. Um, wheel, pretty good as well. Rear door, very nice. Driver's door, very good. So, like I say, all the wheels, all the brakes, all the tyres, all in good condition. So, let's have a look inside, shall we? So, driver's door panel is very good. Now these seats, not only are they electric, they're incredibly supportive. I mean, Ford have always had this great relationship with the Recaro seats. And you look at that seat, you've got a small amount of creasing on the actual bolster on the side there, but the actual seat itself is in really, really good condition. There's no damage from um, people getting in with a, I don't know, a biro in their pocket or something like that. You've also got a great multifunction steering wheel. As with most Fords, but certainly at this level, you've got so many, many features on the vehicle. And the other nice thing is you've got this um, control, well, not control, you've got these um, displays here, which are really good. So you've got your oil temperature, your turbo boost, and your oil pressure. So they're all really quite, sensible um, information uh, points to be uh, uh, given to the driver. Um, you've also got full climate control, heated uh, front screen, which most of the Fords have because I think it was a Ford invention actually. 
Um, you've got, uh, what else have we got? Traction controls, six gears. So it's a very, very nicely spec car. Um, so let's have a look in the back as well. So look at that panel. Very, very nice. I don't think anybody's been sitting in the back here. These seats are pretty much as they were. I mean, look at that. It really has got a lovely, lovely interior, this car. We'll just go around and have a look at the other side. So have a look at that. Really lovely seats all up in there is all fine. Carpets are all good. Still got the original carpet mats. Door panels are good. This door panel is really good. Carpet mats. Look at that seat. Hope you can pick that up. It's so good. Such a lovely seat. Sort of things you'd be expecting, you know, some of the really top end cars, 80,000 pounds plus don't have seats that are as good as that. So I'll just start it as well. Why not? Let's start it up. That's what it's all about. I mean, it's a diesel, so it's not going to sound like the petrols, but it certainly is all, all there, all working really well. See if we can have a look under the engine. And there we go. Ticking away nicely. And everything pretty much as it should be. No indications of any damage whatsoever so there you have it you've got a very very nice focus st full service history just had brakes discs um, had its cam belt has just been changed by us um, really lovely car to drive if you're interested in it please do give us a call come and have a test drive we can deliver we do arrange finance we do take part exchange thanks very much for watching